Blue Jays today at Cool Today Park here in North in there for the Blue Jays as well. Of course, Vladimir Guerrero. A guy who has started before, obviously, the very beginning of his career, but that's not what this is. Open. Will this be the opening day lineup? And how does that work? I'm thinking about the different bats. Thanks for spending this day with us. First, and it's going to go off the wall and take a... Clement's going to dig for third. First Aggressive early. No. That'll help his cause. And here is a guy who's certainly much set with still a week left in spring training. And that's a little unorthodox the rest of the way it's to get these regular lineups out there and get the guys ready and Guerrero chased one two and two. this one gets by Murphy Clement will come for a strikeout here off speed pitch below the zone and you see Sean Murphy trying to bat for an out is recorded a burn two batters in it is two well, the good news is it's spring training, and this really doesn't count. It doesn't. And <laughs> eight going yard there. That's a good point, though, and I know it's spring training. Especially when you're coming in in such high intense situations throughout the inning. They'll try to settle in here and get the center field. A couple of years. The guy hits the ball on the ground a lot. I like to talk a lot. Get into the playoffs, but they did not show up. Their bats did not show up. Uh, trying to latch on to one of the final roster spots, of course. back Kevin Biggio another but having a guy like Vogel back for them now that anything that he was working on absolutely you can play with it even in this scenario here maybe find some different things especially in different counts you go for it this one roll thing is gonna hit up above the start here for Iglesias His power is well documented. Sometimes he's a feaster fan. Davis Schneider will dig in. Iglesias now back into that Atlanta Braves bullpen. Swing and a miss. Good job here. Took a lot about this bullpen as things go on here. But Iglesias, you mentioned, we'll get a look at most of the kind of go-to guys here this afternoon. The guys that have done some things. But it's the variety of looks that they have of some power. And a 1-2 is swung on and missed by Eisenhower. Wonderful crowd on hand, as there usually is. But today, Brian Snicker putting in. It will be challenging. And Bowden Francis. All of them out of the bullpen, but a spot had opened up. It's over, and he'll take it. Toronto and Francis right now is the lead candidate. Burn here amongst the Braves contingent, but any time you mention Ronald. You know, Snit and his staff. They can tell you everything seen on the field. You want to see him comfortable. And Ronald went for it, had to kind of bust it, and then slow down the, the plays and the opportunities that he had in that last spring. Ozzie Albies, big swing and a miss. Ozzie thought about it. Yeah, as CJ was kind of saying, he could pop all 091 on the slide. So one fly out. Not much gets looked at at MVP. Not here leading up to the start of the season, the idea that he'd like to get in on that goal. Well, certainly the defense has been much improved. Swing and a miss through a 96. Back in the booth with the organization. And just don't praise. Grounder to the left side. Going up about his defense and his first opportunity for him so far. He is a ground ball master is what he does best. A two-seam fastball, very unique in the way that he throws it. And I think is as good as anybody in the big leagues. Speaking of ground balls, here's another. This, And that will allow Lucas to not only go to... And it gets by Riley. 2024. Any better than that. He did a good job of getting around the baseball. But you see that throw in the dirt. And now Brian Sermon sticks. And I think for Bummer, in addition, with no runners on. Routine for Orlando Arcia. On those kind of tailed off. Another chance for Orlando. This one a little more challenging. Blue Jays have jumped out to a four to nothing lead. Bottom of the second for him. Obviously, thinking about some of those records that he's hurt in 39 RBIs, and can't help but wonder what he has in mind. On the first, he's the Braves' first base runner here this afternoon. 
something last year. Hit a couple of home runs on 3-0 counts last year. Uh, but there's a comfort level, especially when you're down a few runs. And one away in the bottom of the... It's one of the fun things you get to do as a Braves fan is to die. The eight of the starts last year came in the nine hole. Only six came in the six spot. The key for him last year was just getting help. Just missing there. And Michael Harris takes it. Puts this one tighter for left, it goes the short route. I don't know why you throw it at first with two outs, and that will bring up the catcher. And the luxury for the Braves to have that. Over to the second, and that'll do it. Braves strand a runner, two. Sticker from down in the dugout. He's sporting that Florida 10. The guys have been really... Um, good about just typically have your roster set. There's not very many unknowns with think about apartments, wherever they're going to go, and all that. And I think they're very appreciative of the fact they're in spring training. But no doubt, I got to believe for you, one of the things on your mind was this guy. Long layoff. Um, you know, he's still building strength. He's still building velocity, timing with his delivery, which all that stuff will come with time and, and appearance. Bummer and some of the yeah. others. The, the balance of the bullpen just seems to be really. Um, you know, the regulars that they bring over, and plus the fact we could not. Throwing um, him a bone just to get him out of here. At this point, but I think everybody's in shape. They're ready to go. We'll start. Yeah, I'm ready to get going. So having this many great tools, and especially on the offensive, kind of worked his way up to the top of the you know higher in the. You got to start somewhere with everything with the 26 man roster. You know, start somewhere. Uh, speaking of starting somewhere, the regular season here, what he's done the last couple of years, and, and um, you know what, you kind of, yeah, he's on the backfield right now getting stretched out, so, um, you know, he's been, he's been, really long time, go back to the Bobby Cox days, I believe, that's, you know, certainly a big, with these guys, with everybody involved, uh, it kind of gives you, in the 2016 season, and people weren't really sure how long would it be around to just be an interim. It's a strike to Vogel back to make it. And it's nice again going back to the construction shoot. Clips the inside corner. That Guerrero led things off with a walk. He would. Kelnick, bathed in sunshine. To you by Destin, Fort Walton Beach, Florida. The season. And that's something that big. That is fair down there. See ya. An extra base. And his rest of the field has a ton of talent. And Alex Anthopoulos, him. A lot of talk about a right-handed bat. Well, Kelt had it shaded perfectly. Orlando will. Always playing this game every day. And Escobar boots stop Kiner Falefa. For Ronald Acuna, it does play the Braves' first run of the afternoon. Marks are for this Blue Jays infield platoon in both of those positions for the Toronto Blue Jays. Ahead of this, well hit, but pass Tom Goodwin this year. That one misses. Ozzy trusts him with Ron Washington, but they also wanted him to get another opportunity. Washington had been doing with the infielders, not something that everybody else wasn't. They struck out swinging to in the first inning. He's over one. We welcomed you to our crew. We also look beautiful. It's nice not to be the only new guy. Yep. Swing and a miss, and down goes right. Brandon God, CJ Nitkowski, happy to be with you. Our Nine games there for him. He's got that four seam fastball at 95 miles an hour. The slot sitting around 84. Occasional changeup once in a while. About 90. See you back out there. How have you felt so far this spring, partner? And, and sitting back, I, I just did what I what I could to help the team, and um, you know, just kind of you're feeling right again. Yeah, you know, just get back on the bike, you know. Um, get back on the bike, just and uh, uh, you know, getting back into being a player. You know, be talking about uh, things to look for. Were there anybody anybody in particular that all these guys have had had TJ? They all was another one. Um, you know, a little bit going through it. Uh, you know, I was talking to him. So. <laughs> home runs all the time and I feel like I shouldn't be wearing it's bad luck or something but yeah now out there I just need to go out there and do what I need to do so I don't really have any superstitions I know a lot of you know I hope it's in a, a situation where the team's uh winning and I go out
Yeah, I'm wondering, is there anything to the fact that this is a really deep bullpen that maybe a huge workload? I'm going to go in, do what I can do, and, um, you know, pen. And, uh, yeah, I'm, I'm excited just to be part of it. And you did. I'm with us. As I said, we're just excited to see you back out there, and we will see you in that vibe, quite honestly, up and down. Uh, this clubhouse with the brakes just good. It felt like a small bump in the road, quite honestly, compared to some other things that he had gone through. He'll be there to be able to pick you up. This one's back our way. Did you think if the Braves had a need in the field and you and I were the options, <laughs> you would be out there? This one gets over. They're going to dig for yeah, extra bases. Oh. Knights. Is there room? And Matt Olson takes it. Play Rutschman. Straight to the ball. There. Hitting the ball is the hole. I'm looking for spin. I tell you what, that is right in the hot zone of Xander Bogarts. Harris is over for one. And the ball in a strike. A milestone moment. For a bit that they can enjoy that here in Pittsburgh. How do we feel about it? So he takes it out on the Phillies to start the season. We've seen ahead of it. Speaking of top shelves, that one a little high. Jays with a four to one lead. Oh, there's nothing better than that over for Atlanta. And the first pitch he fires to Clement is foul. And AJ Minter, you can see the 70 games last year, the last two seasons, the number maybe comes down by a couple of ticks to keep him healthier and stronger throughout the year. Off single here to Clement, who's had a nice out. And AJ turned the way he wants them to. And now three lefties do here. In the Playing over at first base. Runner goes. And a good pitch to run on. Go on first move, and as soon as AJ lifted, and right. he got him though, challenged him, and a sort of face. And Dalton Varsho, but with the Blue Jays, most of that pitching back. Expectations, I think, definitely high in Toronto to do their success. Ooh. Chen music, lead the sweep. Himself. Two away, runner advances. Went 0 2 against the Minnesota Twins, and he got a contract extension. Sometimes management has interesting ideas. Fun atmosphere up there. A great crowd. Really great trip. They've made some adjustments and some renovations to that. Good block by Sean Murphy. Came to balls in the dirt, and he was the best. Yeah, there was a lot of talk about his. But that's big. It's built with confidence. But you got a great block. A walk for Daniel Vogelback. And Sean Murphy is the border right now. So you start down in Florida and then in southern Texas. Eight up Austin Riley. I see it, but no chance to get Schneider. We saw a similar play that the higher pitch count. Want to be careful here. It's only spring training. Yes, the that's your tickets for this commemorative giveaway here, and it's 7:15. What a night that should be! That's going to be a great one. Uh, this year in high A ball did make a brief stint in double A as well. And when he was trotting in from the bullpen, he just kind of has that and two out. T. Albies takes it right off the dirt for out. He's got three in the first. They've had the lead ever since. Toronto. So. I would guess pretty good chance that Murphy for the highest hit ball here so far this afternoon. It's Clement with him here real high. I'm perfectly fine with that net yeah. being where it is. <laughs> There's a hit for Orlando, a two hit day for him. They'll run out of room. That really was a tale of kind of. And it really derailed his season. He didn't come back until his Braves lineup is. Francis with a 2-2 pitch, and this one is fouled. It's the last thing you're thinking about, right? Yeah. And Kelnick's going to call time. And another foul ball. The battle continues. 6 a.m. or whatever it started. 
of a foul ball parade continues. Maybe not where he wants them to be in spring training. It's good as talked about, right? And there will be a 12th. That got a piece. 3 2 is scorched up. Oh, will head to third. And with one out in the fifth. Indeed, that is it for Bowden Francis at Cool Today Park for Toronto. And a plugs the gap in left center. It's two RBI double for. Around, you're going to see a first pitch fastball. They wanted it higher. Well, as soon as you saw a little bit of that bobble in left center. Ronald, though, is good as anybody of baseball. The batting average in the game is always going to be on the first pitch of an at-bat. You see some made their opening day roster last year. Tried to get Ozzie to expand that zone. Gonna score. Everything looked right until it came out of his hand. Oh, for them. Schneider throwing away. And this ball game is going to be tied. Play with his first hit. It produces a run. And the Braves. And quite honestly, not a, a great pitch here. 0 2. And a meeting on the mound right now. That will be it for his return. Fifth and each team with five runs now. Braves bringing the lump lineup. Yeah, kind of wild. I mean, you can have so much fun digging in off right at the top in Major League Baseball. Well, this guy certainly helped tie this game up. A big spot. So just on the end. Brown Zappin, and then all of a sudden he turns it around and ends up having talent. It happens every player to get a little bit older. A couple of days off, it was for the Braves, number 307 to tie that record on the last. And but the game is now tied as we go to the sixth. Now Pierce Johnson came over to Atlanta last year. Good note there on the 24 games that he pitched with the ERA. Started using that breaking pitch a little bit more. He's right near Colorado were good, but they're always it takes it. But Pierce Johnson had earlier that one ate him up over there on the third base side. I came down here right as position players were reported. Give your wife a little bit of a push. Not straight to the golf course. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Start the sixth. Or with one out here this week, I think guys kind of start turning it on a little bit, getting a little bit more serious about. In there for a strike. So fractured his right hand. Backhanded play. Chance to turn throw, and it was close here. As you're gonna throw here, you see Ozzy had to go a little bit turned around to make that throw, but still field as well today. To this afternoon, he waits, he takes, and our Sonovas get their interview of the game. Is the Braves for this partner? We have not had a chance to catch up with you yet this spring. How good? Um, you know, swings feeling good. Atlanta Braves, but I know that that postseason left. Uh, we got to stay healthy um, and, and take the you know first. Um, you know, going here in about a week or so. So you've been through this quite a few times now. So, you know, like I said, just trying to have a. Uh, Bees, that ball is long gone. Hammer. He was due. He missed. He just been, came into the dugout uh, that last Take a six to five lead. Uh, we talked so much about all. Still some work to do, but, uh, you know, I, I really like where I'm at. I want to ask about that last at bat that you talked about and a good one that RBI single that into how many at bats, how many innings you want to play again as we get to this point in spring training. The 40 to 50 range, I think, is, is you know, key. That you and your wife, Anna, are expecting another one? We are, August August 2nd. He can crush the ball. A tradition like no other. Orlando Arcia takes it in. 98 miles an hour last year, and you can see that higher ERA, 94. Lefty here crushes this. So Kelnick, his bat is coming this time. Go ahead and jump on a first pitch fastball that split the plate. He was ready for it. So a good sign for one of the Braves, Nuke Esposito. So it's Exposito at third. They're at the corners. 
Acuna has driven in four of the seven. That baseball, he tapped himself on the helmet a couple times with his bat, however. Well, Ronald Acuna is upset with sack flies. Ozzie takes it way outside, 2-0. A lot of guys golfing in the off. Swing and a miss, two and two. In training activity. He tried to stop his bat, but he got a third base. That